Ball inside to Leah Boston, immediately drawing three defenders. Steps through anyway. Court awareness. Saxon running the floor hard, trying to get the early post up. Boston right over Creighton. Bratsky for three. Look, Creighton is second in the nation. They do against a Gamecock defense who only allows opponents to shoot 26% from behind the arc. Today, look, you just chipped in and did a little bit of everything. We also talked about calling a baseball game. That's a terrific cut by Victoria Saxon. Oh, almost a turnover. Bree Beal got it back, and the layup. Bill's not going to quit on a play, and I. Carolina, very intentional right now. They're looking for paint points. They're trying to get touches inside as much as possible. Bree Beal drives the basketball inside. Rachel Saunders with the three. Cook's coming off a, a much better offensive performance than we've seen recently. 15 points on Friday. Floater coming from Molly Mogensen. We give it to her again. Her set drives too deep. The kick out to Henny for three. Would their size of South Carolina affect where they rush their layups? To me, it looks like that so far in the first quarter. Well, this Molly is time. Exactly. Oh, watch oh, out. Watch out. <laughs> Destiny Henderson. But South Carolina is still finding a way to get inside. Under a minute to go in the first quarter. Camila Cardoso using all of her 6'7 to grab that basketball. Is back for Creighton. Back to Boston. Wow, she drove. Henderson takes the no-look pass from Beal and sinks it. Show me here. The step through. Creighton players, every time Aaliyah comes in on the block, there's at least three that are paying attention of where she is. That time. Courtney, something that is impressive about South Carolina's defense is that they. LA immediately drawing two defenders. Reveal, trying to sneak around the back. Bully ball. I knew it was coming. Her responsibility is Bree Bill, but she's not leaving the paint. Look at Aaliyah Boston. She's pointing exactly where the ball needs to go. And then give it to me. Snuck in on behind. Slow down the ball. Go into Aaliyah Boston as they've got to put some ball pressure on. Bree Beal saw a lane. Her offense is coming. Don Staley told Steffi Sorensen, the experts, Question the offense of South Carolina. Beal trying to reposition. Saxton, rebound, put back. Gets too much on the glass. Zion Cook elevates in and out. Cook has not scored yet. Rebound and put back. Get that motor from, and she pointed straight to her chest. She said it is all heart. You gotta love that, a player that won't the ball movement for South Carolina today has much, been much improved. It's made the offense work. That's just the second turnover by the Gamecocks tonight, and Lauren Jensen will take it. Yeah, this sophomore class for Creighton accounts for 67% of their total points. As Bree Beal is fouled. Look at Bree Beal getting herself into double figure. With cuts, running the defense off screens. Oh, rolled around a couple of times, but it did drop for Morgan Molly. We're number two in blue. We asked her teammates who's the most competitive on the team, and they immediately said Tatum. Rachel Saunders with the layup. 
She felt like she rushed her shot. She did. She regressed a little bit, but she corrected it when she got to playing against North Carolina. Yeah, March 30th, we will find out who the Naismith Player of the Year is. They have six XCC regular season titles. They won that title this season. They were upset by Kentucky in the SEC Tournament Championship game as Lily Grissett. Season, and she has gotten back to the Lily Grissett Don Staley was looking for. Cardoso, right over the defense. And Creighton calls timeout. What about South Carolina's offense? Well, we have seen games. Ooh, I told you the three from Creighton, but we have seen games. That's not her number one priority. She is looking at count how many games there are between now. You can't do that against South Carolina because their post play can defend like guards. It's going to be a battle. Two tough defensive teams. They've got a lot of grit about them. Nas Hillman, a strong rebounder. It's been an impressive display for the Gamecocks. And that offense for South Carolina, we were looking behind us between Stanford and Texas. Yeah, that's coming up top of the hour. Intentional about getting the ball inside. Intentional about communication defensively. Nia Russell. Bucket for Jamie Horan. Gamecocks are becoming a staple in the final four. They'll be there for the fourth time. You want to be playing your best basketball right now as 